best friends. Today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Glass. <coughs> Abraham be test. Abraham's back. Yes. Abraham and Isaac. Isaac, Isaac, Isaac. Um, hello. My name is Ah. Um, God promised Abraham a son. And from that son, many distances, <laughs> he would bless the whole world. But Abraham and his wife Sarah was too old to have a children. So God promised in yesterday's story that Abraham will have a son and he will have more distance than the stars. Yes, yes. Oh, ah! oh. <laughs> I still want You just call. But Abraham and Sarah was too old. Twenty years went by. Still, Abraham trusts God's promise when he had. When he was hundred and Sarah was ninety, God remem remind them of his promise. Sarah was going to have a baby. <coughs> so twenty years went by, but still Abraham was trusting God because God promise never broke. After 20 years, Sarah had the baby. They're looking happy. When their son was born, Sarah was so joyful that she laughed. God has brought me a laughter, he, she said. So they named their son Isaac, which means he laughs. So they were so happy because they had a son. So they were so joyful because because of their son and they named their son Isaac which means he laughs Ouch. God promised Abraham a son whose descendants will bless the world. True. When Isaac was a boy, God tested Abraham by telling him to take Isaac to Mount Moriah and kill him as a sacrifice to God. Abraham was confused, but he still trusts God. So, like, when Isaac was a boy, God tested Abraham like, to sacrifice Isaac. If he have to sacrifice Isaac, he have to kill him. But still, Abraham trusts God. 
But can you? If you have a baby, can you give the baby as a sacrifice? Isaac carried the wood, and Abraham held the knife and flaming torch. Together, they climbed up the mountain. Where is the lamp for the sacrifice? Asked Isaac. God will prove it. Abraham replied. So, Isaac carried the wood. And they started to climb up together. And... They're going. <laughs> oh, he just doesn't know anything. He's laughing. Abraham arranged the wood on an altar tied up Isaac and laid them on the wood as he raised the knife to kill Isaac and the angel called his name Abraham so Abraham arranged the, the wood on the altar and tied up Isaac and when he was going to kill Isaac as a sacrifice and angel called his name Abraham. <laughs> Question: What did God tell Abraham to kill as a sacrifice? Number one, a donkey. Number two, his son Isaac. Number three, a sheep. Number two was the correct answer. Don't hurt the boy, the angel cried. God knows you trust him. His promise, look there in the bush. A ram is cut by his horn. Sacrifice that instead. So what the voice was telling, don't hurt the boy. God knows that you trust his promise. And like, Sacrifice the goat a ram instead. Oh, Isaac will be very like mm. they will be very happy because Abraham will and Isaac will not very will uh, will be very happy because Isaac doesn't have to die. So Abraham sacrificed the, the ram instead of his son. He called the place God will produce because God <coughs> produced the sacrifice just as God, God has said. His promise came true. So Abraham's promise came true. God never forget or break the promise. Question, did Abraham believe God would really keep his promise? Yes. Yes, today we read the Bible story. Did you enjoy the next time? I'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye.